Uh, we'll get to the two exciting teams here. Uh, second most exciting team out of the AFC North South, excuse me, is the Indianapolis Colts. And they're exciting because hopefully their athletic quarterback is going to stay healthy. And if not, that's guess really, what? They got Joe Flacco, baby. That's really what we feel like their season hinges on. Am I wrong? If, uh, if, Anthony Richards, if Anthony Richardson is healthy all year, they have a good season. If he gets hurt early enough, their season is shit. No. Am no. I, I wrong? You are oh, wrong. Hang on, remind me, Sean, who was who was the quarterback that came in last year uh, for for the Colts? Was it uh, was it was Garner Minshew? Garner Minshew. Garner Minshew. So with a league average, maybe slightly above average, however you want to, however you want to classify. He's Trevor Tiger. Lawrence. Hold and on, Trevor hold on, Lawrence is Garner Minshew. So with a league average, slightly above league average quarterback, they missed the playoffs by a half game. And now they have an elite quarterback and backup. Sure. So even if Anthony Richardson goes down, uh, may, maybe like, like they, they've odds. got the I like the odds of them making the playoffs regardless of who's at quarterback. I think they could have Deshaun Watson at quarterback and still make the playoffs. Yeah. Stop bringing him up. <laughs> it gets Sean on on a bad in a, in a bad me. spot. <laughs> you don't like uh, massages. No, bro. I yeah. I think yeah. With Anthony Richardson, it's a playoff team. Without they are not. It's simple as that. Simple wrong, as man. that. Can I you guys tell where my mic is when I lean wrong. to the right and yell into yeah, it? Yeah, because all our podcast listeners can actually see you doing that. Yeah, we have to the right. To the right. Oh, whoa. <laughs> 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 Leave me alone. <laughs> no, they, they seem very exciting. Jonathan Taylor is back. Seems like he's back. Jonathan to Taylor more. Thomas. Uh, God damn it. Got out of home improvement. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Michael Pittman resigned. They're exciting. Guys, this has been our worst show. <laughs> so bad. So bad. <laughs> Sorry, listener. Uh, <laughs> clearly came in unprepared. Good lord. <laughs> oh fuck. <laughs> we are we talking about the Texans yet? No. no. <laughs> we barely talked about the Colts. We, we said four things about Anthony Richardson, <laughs> and then we're like, oh, okay, we're done. <laughs> They're not exciting, dude. Ooh. You got Michael Pittman, Pittman Jr. You got Josh Downs. You got Adnai Mitchell out of Texas. And this receiving floor is really good. It's really strong. Regardless of if you have Anthony Richardson or Joe Flacco under center, maybe it's Sam Ellinger. Like these receivers are going to carry this team forward. And I don't, know. don't forget if... about the defense. Like the defense is still very, very good. You still have Grover Stewart and DeForest Buckner there on the defensive line. Um, you've got the President Larry Grover Franklin. Stewart. Yeah. Nice. President. <laughs> uh, that one took him out. He doesn't know where he's at. I don't. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's going on. I I think yes, their receivers are good. Um, it's a little. It's a little crowded for for just like any random quarterback to be able to like get like the their playmakers the ball but i'm i'm going to hold behind that they're a playoff 100% they're a playoff team with anthony anthony richardson and with a with a backup quarterback they're just not they're very they're flat guys they're not well, I don't Jonathan know if you guys Taylor, saw it. I don't know if you guys saw it or not but in the joint practice the Bengals were making fun of anthony richardson because all he did was run so they have this great receiving core that you guys are just talking about, but he's out there and he's not passing the ball. What good is that to have them? Interesting point. Maybe they were hiding it so that nobody could get film on him since they didn't get any film on him last year. Oh, he ran a lot. That's so big brain. 
They're Vegas just has like, them. They're like three steps ahead, bro. Vegas has them at eight and a half. So Ooh. I put the Jags over, and I'm 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 the, the Jags and the Colts are going to be competing. So I'm going to go Colts over here, regardless of all the shit that I talked on them. Because I'm hoping Anthony Richardson stays healthy. I do not wish him any ill will. I hope he's healthy. I hope the Colts make the playoffs. I hope he stays healthy all year as well, but I just see Joe Flacco coming in and playing a substantial amount of games this year for him. So give me Get the that over. man's name out of your mouth. No, Sean. Sean, you need to seek therapy. Joe this Flacco. Is therapy. You never value. give up on an elite quarterback. Never. This is this is enough. Never Joe give Flacco. in. Never give up. Tybo, you said over, under, over, over. I also took over. Over, under. How many games? Anthony Richardson plays this year. Ten and a half. Over. He plays all 17. Over. Going crazy. I give him 13. Jaden Daniels, on the other hand. Four. Whoa. Whoa. We're not talking about Jaden Daniels now. 